Hey guys, it's Connor here. Welcome back. Hope you're all enjoying it. Your day so far. Happy Friday. We're almost there to the weekend. All right, so I've got a batch of new candle reviews to share with you guys today. We're taking a break from the Kringle reviews and we're going to do a couple of Hallmarks candle reviews. So um, I'm going to have three reviews in total today. Two of these are new releases from Homeworks on homeworks.shop. And then a little bit later in the afternoon, I will show uh, or I will share with you guys my new my newest QVC purchase. Um, it's a returning scent. It is the Cranberry Pumpkin Cake. Um, I will share that review with you soon. It's actually what's burning right there in the background. Um, anyways, though, first up, I'm going to share with you guys my thoughts on the new scent called Coffee Shop. I'm really excited to share this candle with you guys. Um, there has been some mixed um, feedback and feelings about this one. Um, there are a lot that don't like it and there are a lot that do like it. Um, I am in the field where I really, really like the scent. Um, I really enjoyed it ever since it was on cold. Um, it does have a note that I think could be a little bit polarizing for some people and could probably turn a lot of people off from this one. But in my opinion, this is a delicious, amazing coffee fragrance. Um, so let's get right into the notes here. So the notes read roasted coffee beans, vanilla syrup, steamed milk, and nutmeg. All right, so this one um, is a definitely a roasted coffee scent. Um, to me, this is not a latte. It is not a um, like creamy milk scent. This is definitely a roasted coffee. Like it smells like this cup right here. It has no milk. It's just that black, freshly brewed roasted coffee. And I really was looking for a good roasted coffee scent because there are a lot of coffee scents out there that are the milky latte type scents. And don't get me wrong, I really like those, but... I feel like there's not a ton of just like roasted coffee scents and the ones that are out there I'm not really a fan of so like Bath and Body Works Paris Cafe. I don't love that one. I actually think that that one's a little bit more like a latte as well. It definitely has a creamy note to it but this one is just a delicious roasted coffee with no milk. All right let's talk about the nutmeg note because that is what has been throwing some people off the nutmeg. There is definitely a lot of nutmeg in here, and I know that a lot of you could use some less of that nutmeg note. I personally love nutmeg. I love the spice. I love smelling it in my fragrances. I just, I love nutmeg. I'm a big spice person, so I definitely don't mind the nutmeg in here. I actually enjoy the nutmeg. Um, I think it adds a nice touch to the coffee note in here. But I know that it's throwing some of you off, so if you're not a fan of nutmeg, then I probably would avoid this one. It is definitely heavy on the nutmeg, and um, it's definitely showing up in here. So if you're not a fan of nutmeg, you may want to avoid. Um, the other notes, vanilla syrup. I might get a slight vanilla note in here, but I don't get the steamed milk. Like I said, this is just a roasted coffee, like espresso fragrance. I don't think that it has any like milkiness or creaminess to it. Um, this is just a really nice roasted coffee. Sorry if you hear a noise in the background. I think that there is some work being done outside. Hopefully this new camera is not um, picking it up. Anyways, though, that is my thoughts on the scent. Let me know your thoughts down below in the comments. I would love to hear what you guys think. Do you like nutmeg fragrances as well? I would love to hear what everybody's opinion is. All right, let's talk about the performance on this one. I will go ahead and uh, give you guys an overhead view here. I am at the halfway point right now. Here is your overhead view. Um, I am already at the halfway point on this one. Um, as you can see, we are about right here in the burn. And I am so happy to say that this is probably one of the best performing homework scandals that I've had this year yet. Um, I feel like there has been a lot of misses. Um, there's obviously been some hits, but there's been a lot of misses with Homeworks candles lately, and I'm so happy that this one was a hit. Um, 
The burn on this one is doing fantastic for me. Um, the wicks are doing great. As you can see, they are not super puny, which is something that I'm dealing with with the uh, next candle I'm going to review. Um, so stay tuned for that. But um, this one has great wicks. The wicks seem to be slightly thicker, so um, I am having to trim them. But I do really enjoy how those wicks have nice um, large flames. They don't soot or anything like that. But they just have those nice flames. I am trimming them after every burn so that they're not setting. But the flames are doing great. They do kind of want to lean over um, while you get a bigger pool of wax. So after I blow it out while it's still liquefied, I like to just um, kind of like recenter the wicks. So that's the only thing that I'm doing for this one. But the burn is doing great. Um, strength and throw on this one is a solid like eight you guys i'm not getting an eight from a homeworks candle in a while and that is what i'm getting from this one and the strength is an eight the throw is probably like a nine almost this one really gets close to filling up my entire house it definitely fills up the entire downstairs um if it filled up down and up i think i would give it a 10 for throw but the the throw for me right now is a nine because it is filling up the entire downstairs. I've been burning it in the kitchen and it really kind of is one of those fragrances that's going to punch you in the face. So if you like a strong fragrance, then I really would suggest this one to you. I'm just really, really happy with the performance of this one. So much so that I'm actually considering picking up a few more on my next order. This one is still in stock right now on the Homeworks website, on homeworks.shop. I will leave a link down below where you can shop. There is a sale right now. You're saving $8, so it goes down to $22. And then you can also stack my discount code, which is Connor Loves Candles, and that will save you an additional 15% off. So really good deal going on right now. So if you do want to try this one, right now is a great time to. And I'm actually considering... Um, placing an order for a few more of these. I don't want to go crazy or anything, but I think this would be a great scent during the holidays. I think this would be really a good all year round scent. It's just a solid coffee fragrance. I could see this one being really good after the new year as well, like in January and February when I'm not really sure what to burn. I think that this one would be really nice for then. But it's just a really nice roasted coffee scent with that um, nutmeg in there. It's just so good. So, yeah, guys, let me know your thoughts on the coffee shop from Homeworks. Are you a fan or are you not? Again, check out the description for a couple of links. Um, I'll try and leave some stuff down there. Um, and stay tuned for the two other reviews coming today. I will see you guys then. Make sure to like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys then. Bye.